First thing the Senate kind of looks like it's teeing up is COVID liability. Essentially, um, if you were just doing what you thought was right, you don't get sued over COVID, right? Right, right. right. And, I, and I think that's critical. I think when we were in the heat of the battle, I want to say definitely in the trenches, we were asking Missouri companies all over the state. I was personally calling people on the phone, saying, would you be willing to remanufacture your company to make gowns, to make face masks, to make gloves, whatever it was we needed at the time, and people were willing to do that. Frankly, and I think it's important to remember they brought their employees back in at a time when most of them, a lot of mm -hmm. people would probably have rather stayed at home. Some of them were scared and everything, but they come back and went to work. And for our churches, for our schools, for our healthcare workers, for convenience store workers, you just go on down the list. But none of them should have been punished for really trying to help in the middle of a crisis. You know, I, I look at that somewhat like in the, really in the battle of a war. You know, yeah. yeah, you know, sometimes you got to do what you got to do at the time, mm -hmm. you know, to say keep the high ground. And that's exactly where the position we were in. So but to, if you do find a bad actor out there, I mean, you still could raise a suit. And, right? and I think you could. If you yeah. still found a bad actor, he's not going to get a free pass. Yeah. You know, we're going to be able to go after that. You know, just the way the, the way the language is. But what we're basically saying in this language, what I'm not sure what the finished product will be. Yeah. But what I'm saying is if you didn't intentionally to commit a forgery or commit a crime or do something, you know, we want to go make sure you're protected. You know, if a guy wanted to go to church and the pastor says, hey, my church is yeah. open, I don't want that guy to be sued because somebody got COVID-19 in there. If you went to school and you did what you're supposed to do, like 83% of our kids were in classroom settings. I don't want them to be subject to lawsuits because somebody had them to go to school. I don't want school administrators to be sued for that.